Good morning, day fam. Welcome to a brand new day. Every single day holds the possibility of a miracle. Wake up and be proud to see what God has planned for you. Don't want to forget my water. Gabby and I are headed down to the barn. Ooh. Our living room is turned into a show living room. Basically, we got saddles and bridles and saddles and helmets and oils and boots and girths and oh yeah, you name it, we got it. Oh, well, that's just Sophia. That's her sleeping. Oh, you took a picture. Why do you take a picture of your sister sleeping? That's so, so rude. Anyway, we are going for an early morning Yeah. Park. So, Gabby and I are headed down to the bar. We're going to do chores, feed the ponies, and then Gabby and I are going to go on a hack because we want to just kind of get relaxed and have fun before we start the whole pre-show proceedings, right? We're going to we're going to do it. Like, I'm going to ride Stella. Right? I think I'm gonna ride Storm Bear Rack because I'm not gonna ride in my saddle. It's up here, so like why? On the road, you're gonna ride in Bear Rack? Wear your saddle if you want to. I'll bring it down. All right, ride Bear Rack. We have a water, two buckets of water, heating up for bath time. Hey, Mr. Hendricks, how you doing, sir? Meow, yeah, you need food? Come on, I'll take you to get some food. You always beat me to it, huh? Look, your food is right here in a bucket. There you go. Good boy. You're such a happy boy. Yeah, you are. Oh, you need lots of snuggles. So, um, do you guys remember when I told you about when Gabby and Storm, their bond started to really grow? And it was in the summer. And it was because she did something just for him. After she would ride him, she would take him. Remember, at our old barn, they didn't have grass. She would take him to the field and stand with him while he ate grass. And that was a pivotal moment. And I have a relationship with Storm and Finn. Like they both look at me as a, as a herd mate. Like I know that I have a relationship with both of them. Finn looks at me as like a mom, like a, a somebody who's gonna, he's gonna run to when he needs help. He looks at me as somebody that's a part of his team, like a, a friend. And a Storm looks at me kind of the same way. And Stella does not look at me. Like some of you guys are like, oh, you guys are building a relationship, but we're not. Like Willow, I pick her feet and I do brush her um, more and more all the time. We do not have a relationship either. I love her, but she doesn't bond with me the way that she does with Sophie. Um, and Stella, nah, nothing. But last night, I was in her, I was waiting for Gabby, she's pulling Maine, and we were down here for a long time doing nighttime routine, and I was in doing Stella's feet. I do her feet, I groom her, nothing, nada. And then last night, I was doing her tail, I was braiding it, just kind of hanging out in her stall, she doesn't care. And then I noticed that her vagina was all covered in gunk. So I got some of my wet wipes and I cleaned it off. And as I was cleaning her off, she looked at me the same way Storm and Finn look at me. And I was like, I'm doing something nice for her. Like, obviously it's like super itchy there. So then I took my wet wipes and I cleaned all up under her tail where it gets like really gunky and yucky and itchy. And I scrubbed, I cleaned it first and then I scrubbed it while she was itchy and I could tell it was like what she needed. And the whole entire time she was staring at me. Like, and that, those are the moments that I've had with Storm and Finn where they just stare at me. Like they're, they're noticing me. They're like, this person is doing something just for me. Like something, and that, the trick of bonding, I feel like. It's the trick, because I do so much with Stella, and I never get that connection with her. But last night, 100%, she was looking at me like, thank you, I needed that, I appreciate you. And that's the connection that I want to build with her. So if you guys are looking to build a connection and you're still struggling, like I've been struggling, like Stella's we've almost had her for a year, I still don't have a connection with her. You have to do something that they appreciate something that just for them that they need that nobody else can do but that you do it so whether it's taking them to eat grass whether it's giving them treats because some horses really um, appreciate that whether it's scratching all their itchy spots or whatever it is you'll know when your horse does this and stares at you because it appreciates what you're doing so yeah I just want to give you that guidance I could be completely wrong, but that's my experience so far. Still, it is show prep day, and Gabby's still pulling mane. I did all of this. I know, last night, like, I don't know, it seems short, but maybe easier braids. Sophie's still sleeping, and I'd rather have a happy Sophie than a grouchy Sophie. So, uh, Sam, you are on a dad show prep, dude. Do you know what your job to do is today? 
Absolutely nothing. Okay, so you have running around to do. We need a few more things. We need water. We need sunscreen. We need to get hay today. Too. We need to get hay. Uh, we need to get a couple things for us to eat while we're away. You need to get money. We need to get gas for my truck. Yeah, you need all the stuff. You need to do the running around. And the other thing is that... Stuff. I know. Well, think about I have a lot too. We're riding. Tomorrow. Maybe it'll rain tomorrow. And it's I'm not going to rain. Be postponed again. No, no. I want to get this sucker over with. We need the first show of the season over with. If Stella takes off with me, I expect you to be riding like a cowgirl with a big rain in your hand and phew, catch me. <laughs> Chase after me. And she said, don't worry, I'll pony you. But I don't think I need it. Yes. Well, oh, I wish you could come. She's going to be here with Finn. Gabby found something. So this is why we hardly Mom. have any bugs. Mom, Sophie, I, Mom. Sophia baby. says it looks like a dead oh flying God. squirrel. This is not a flying squirrel. You guys know what this is? <laughs> it's a bat. It looks like a baby. Oh, that's a big bear. Look at it, Sam. Maybe the cat got it. Good. Hendrix, do you think it's a boy or a girl? Looks like a boy. What's in its mouth? Hair. Hair? Horse hair. That's like fin hair. Fancy a ride, Stella? You go for a ride? Inside. I am not riding horse. Just had grass for the first time in like months. So yeah, that's not gonna happen. All right, we are ready to roll. We are ready to roll. The trick that I use to ride this horse outside on a road where I've never done it before is that I just pretend I can do it. I just like act in my head like, yeah, I'm just gonna go follow Gabby and ride I'm and you. then no, I'm not, I don't need to be ponied. I'm an adult. Yes, you do. No. Uh, it doesn't um, matter if you're an adult, it matters if you can control your horse. I can control my horse. Please God, help me control my horse. <laughs> oh, when you said, um, I just have to bridle the storm. Um, when you said, if Stella takes off on me, you have to run after me. And yeah. I'm like, I'm bareback, like. Yeah, Gabby's riding bareback. Storm's outside, boiled in the sun, so we're gonna go now. I'm excited though. I kind of feel like I'm gonna pee my pants. Oh, hi. Listen, Finn, take care of Willow for me. Willow, do not get an ulcer when we leave, okay? Be good. Threw the horses some hay so they stay in the barn and don't notice us leaving. Trickery. Catastrophe, we misjudged my stirrup, so I got no. You? Yeah. I did mine the perfect length. <laughs> I'm complaining. Kelly, Kelly! Because she started walking. I'm like, fix my and she's like, oh, you're fine. I got no stirrups and no saddle. All right. You think you could fix my stirrups from there? Ah, whoa, Stella! Stella! Oh, God, oh, God, we're going down the big hill. Oh, God. <laughs> you should probably put the camera Okay. So energetic right now. Like, Stella literally knew where we were going and didn't even try and eat grass except for that one time. And the reason was because she's so excited to go. She's just like, get me the heck out of this place. Mm -hmm. Goodbye, farm. Storm's greatest weakness. What? Gravel. But you know, with the long stirrups. I, I have no saddle and no mane to hold on to. Look at this. <laughs> this Look at you on. sassy little thing. You're like complaining about your stirrups. So I'm worried about traffic. Where should we be? You should be on my side. I feel like poor Stella's dragging my big butt up this hill. Poor girl. Not that much hill. I know, but I feel bad because I got the saddle. This is why I wanted a light yeah, saddle. I have like no contact at all. You know what this means? This means that when we go camping this summer, I'm gonna be able to ride this mare. I'm gonna get to go on all the trails with our trainers and all of Kaylee's family. Like, it's gonna be amazing. Remember my dream when I was laying in the hospital and I was like, God, should I give up horses? And I dreamed me in the summer, thinner, cantering a chestnut horse on the beach. That's what I dreamed. 
Storm's gonna spook you. Gabby's like, if anybody's horse spooks, it's gonna be mine. But you know what's amazing? That my little girl wants to be in front. And she's always been like that, wanting to be like at the front, but she's like not that, she wasn't ever that confident of a horse. And yet here she is, uh oh, phone. I've been pushing away everybody I love. I don't know what to do in a sign from above. I just want to be somebody who knows. I keep a really close eye on Estella's crest and it's in a downward spiral right now. And uh, after the ride she just gave me, I'm letting her eat grass. Two minutes of grass is worth like how amazing she just treated me. Won't you save, 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 save me? All right, it is bath time at the day by day farm. And Storm, you don't get too close to that fence. Uh, yeah, that shampoo. Storm is not loving the water. Storm, it's a bath, it'll keep you cool. So, Finn likes hey. he's he like, it. Storm likes it, or Finn likes it? Yeah, we've never bathed two horses side by side before. So our ropes are tied in a break free yeah, way. We haven't even brought out the hose yet. We're just doing the cleaning part but we need all man all men on deck all hands on deck look at storm i know storm like is afraid to get in trouble afraid storm just listens because he doesn't want to get in trouble watch he doesn't get zapped because he'll kick you no don't let him get zapped oh look at him though <laughs> Ooh, that's a lot. I know. I don't like going easy with the shampoo because... Because we are wasters in this family. No, because... Uh-oh, watch out. Stay as clean as you can get. So, Gabby, use this purple shampoo that we have on his hawks. Oh, gosh. Sophie, we got to do the hawks still. Finn. So, Finn does not like his butt cleaned, really. It's not like any part of him. People said don't use too much purple shampoo, but yeah, we're wasters in this family. We are using a lot. I put so much. Yeah, I used, Gabby's shampoo is for bays. Here, maybe, maybe this, Finn is not in love. Finn factor. But this is super enjoyable. I like it. Do you guys like it? Yes, I like it when now. mom's not telling me. Yeah, and the mom freaking out, but I'm done with that now. Okay. So we are using the purple shampoo. I don't know if you guys can see it, but basically. It's actually blue. Mom, what stuff do I use for his mane? Uh, the white, the purple shampoo that Gabby's using. But look, okay. See if I can show you. So that's his blue. dirty foot. This, all I did was wash it, like with yeah. the sponge. I haven't even like done anything. It's like dramatic difference, guys. So right now we're using hot water, warm water, very warm water. It's not, it's not burning hot, but it's, it's not really nice. Cool. Yeah, and soon we're gonna be spraying them with the hose. But look at that tail. Once you dry it up, this is the mo. I knew this was gonna happen. When you uh, bath your horse with other people, like a group of people, it's always like a com. Oh my god, it's like you bath all the brown off of him. What? Do you guys see it? Look at he's like light brown up there now. Yeah. Look. Do you see the light brown? No. Oh my gosh, oh, yeah. he's like really baying That's out. What happens when um he gets um quick get some shoe polish? I like him dark. But look at his neck is nice and clean, no, no mom, cuts. It's because he's wet right now. Okay, don't use a whole bottle. Like I was joking. I didn't. I know, but I I mean I'm just saying like. I didn't mean to put that much. Oh my God, half a bottle gone. But we are good at cleaning. Look at his mane. Oh. Yeah, we are taking our time and doing a really good job. Like this is a 
only bath they're gonna get for a month and this is all the winter dirt on them. I need to do those front Cow, feet. Wow, your horse is all yellow. But look at, can you guys appreciate, let's do a little. That's how Storm turned when I just put water Let's do a little out. montage of how sleek this boy looks. You're looking like a soap machine. You're such a good boy. Like this dude had no idea what this is, what was happening. Look at how short his mane is though. And I have to try and get it on this side. I think we're in trouble. I'm pouring it. Let's go slow. Let it dry on that side. So like on the It's gonna be water, Finny. Calm down. Hey. Okay, go ahead. He's stress eating. He's stress eating. Good boy, yes. You got it, buddy. All right, you're rinsing, you're okay. Yeah, we need a spray thing. You're okay, Finn, Finn, it's okay, you're okay. You got this, dude. It's nice day to have cold water on you. It's so hot out here. You're okay, you're okay, Finn. Look at how handsome this boy is. Being such a trooper, yeah. You need to get really get all this shampoo off. He's like, I will kick you, mom. You're okay. You're used to this storm. Doesn't it feel good to get nice and cool? He's like, heck, no. Look at where. Look at the girls. Do you guys see the girls? The girls that were out here until the water started flowing. They disappeared pretty darn fast. Don't you bite me. Ah. Yeah, I, I feel so sad that your dark color's gone. So this is the beauty in having a Palomino. Like, oh my gosh, getting it that clean is such an amazing Where feeling. Okay, horses are all nice and dry, or at least Storm is, looking good. And now he's getting some show sheen. Can you guys see the bay though? Like where he's baying out? Oops, ew. Oh, look at that. Like. You can really see it in his butt. So half of the brown, the black that was Storm, must have been dirt. Look at his tail. Look at your tail. Oh, you see the red? That makes me miss Sabrina. He has red in his tail. A lot of red. So I got to help her with the braiding situation. Gabby's learning to do it. She's rocking it. Uh, like she always does everything well. I shouldn't have been surprised. Um, yeah, Sophie's helping me with Finch, keeping him calm. Exactly. Good, so now they all have to be that same length. I got 15. And the same width. So figure out how far, like measure with your finger or your comb or whatever. We got Sleeping Beauty over here. Love Bird over here. She keeps on smelling uh, Finn's butt, which is not good because it makes him antsy. That tail though. We're standing here and the wind is blowing through. It's like a scorching hot day and we're just like so nice and cool and relaxed you got the whole gang oh where'd hendrix go and then there's hendrix too so these are my braids so far i mean it's a bit messy and i am doing something wrong down here obviously um and i look over and i see gabby's two perfect braids and i'm like gabby do not show me up do not show me up but i mean if she just have you even ever done a braid before yes i do braids in your own hair? No, in horses. Like, what else can you do for you? Right. Basically, mine are a new beginner braid. Okay, I'm just. <laughs> Basically, yeah. Finn's gonna have really bad braids, and we're just all gonna have to deal. So it's gonna be one of the elephants in the closet, and it's gonna be like an elephant in the room, and nobody talks about it. Okay, it's just gonna have to happen. Cause yeah. I have three down. I'm doing my fourth. Smell it. You smell it, Finny? We're almost done. In the final part of it, and Sam brought us all supper. Are you guys ready to eat? All right, give it to me, baby. So everybody, the top one. Okay. Everybody plays a. Uh oh, everybody plays a role in our family. Oh, yum. Mmm, thank you. Rice and chicken. Thank you.
They're like, let me eat some. Have you ever eaten with horses before? <laughs> this is what happens. <laughs> this is what happens. <laughs> These are the ugliest, can you see them? Ugliest braids I ever saw in my life. The ugliest, no, you know what though? We I'm did it, we anymore. tried our hardest. You like them? Sophie. <laughs> Sophie, Sophie, if anybody says, listen, if anybody asks you if you did your own braids, say yes. <laughs> no, I'm saying my mom did it. What about the tail? Oh, maybe if I braid his tail really pretty, people won't notice the, like what really kills me though is like it takes so many hours to get these ugly things like like uh, you would think I only spent three minutes instead of four hours. They're cute, but I oh I see what you mean. It's because his hair's long. That's all. But yeah, you could. I yeah, see attach it to like that. Oh, yours are way nicer. It'd be better like that. <coughs> That's what I'm gonna do. Yeah, That's we can do it. Phrase. Yeah, we can do it. All right, we are ready. Other than.